hi guys welcome back to my channel so in this video i am going to be reviewing three new scents for bath and body works um raspberry tangerine pink watermelon and boardwalk taffy so yeah thank you for tuning in today you guys please be sure to subscribe and hit your notification bell so you never miss any of my uploads and we shall get started. Okay, so since none of the fragrance notes are actually written on the backs of the Frying Fragrance Mist bottles, um, I just have my handy dandy iPad here. So I will read off the scents as we go along. I'm just on the Bath and Body Works website. So yeah, hopefully by now um, more stores have opened up. Um, I know a lot of you guys are super frustrated um, about the online selection and about the stores still being closed. And I'm just so sad for you guys. Hopefully they open up soon and hopefully they give us some coupons, like seriously, and bring out more 75% off items. I knew this time around semi-annual sale was going to be tough, but I didn't, you know, think that it would just be like, Oh, this tough, you know, but we're going to get through it. You guys, you know, it's important to just be safe and, you know, just try to be as positive as possible. Okay. Because there are worse things going on in the world. Okay. So we're going to start off with boardwalk taffy. Okay. And boardwalk taffy, you have, you know, your, your basic eight ounces. This retails for $15 and 50 cents. On the actual website, it is not on sale. It was on sale when I bought it in store. Okay, it's a nostalgic summertime treat of spun sugar, pink berries, and whipped vanilla. And first off, I just love this packaging. I just love it, you guys. But you know, I was thinking I would have loved to have actually seen Taffy Candle. I mean, ta <laughs> taffy candy on the actual label um the little sailboat is cute it gives a nice summer vibes i love the pink um with these little scrolls here so beautiful and on the back i i was telling you guys that um in you know the previous videos um the back is just as beautiful as the front and it reads summer days spent strolling the boardwalk with the smell of saltwater taffy in the air wouldn't that have been a gorgeous picture to put on here oh my goodness i love boardwalks you guys oh oh my gosh i love summer so anyhow um i do love this packaging uh so yeah now in this collection beachfront blanket though is the best as far as packaging uh yeah and i think as far as scent as well but anyhow let me do this review uh yeah, okay let me just okay this is the one that everyone was going crazy about including myself including myself i actually thought that this one would be my fave i mean taffy come on it is sweet it's cotton candy and powdery all rolled into one, which is nice and fun. And it's soft. And it smells really good. Um, but it's just a bit, hmm, like uninteresting to me. And it smells like so many other of the sweet sugary scents that Bath & Body Works has done. Um, and actually, it really reminds me of um, Confetti Cake Pop. Let me see here, hold on just a second. Okay, so <laughs> behind me, I just grabbed out my um, Confetti Cake Pop. And to be honest, you guys, it pretty much, I got some hair on it, hold on a second. Oh. Um, it pretty much smells the same. Um, and with all the sugary sweet scents they released um, during Christmas time, it smells the same, you guys, as Confetti Cake Pop. I really wanted more candy. I know that they're sweetened and kind of, you know, along the candy cake sweets, you know, scent. So they're going to kind of smell the similar. But I really wanted more of that, like, taffy scent. I don't know. Um, this one is not my fave. It smells good, but I have tons of things that already smell sweet, sugary, and light musky like this. Um, so yeah, it's, it, it smells good, but I just was so excited. I thought it was just going to be like, I don't know, you guys, 
I was just expecting a lot more intense candy, I guess, and some fun flavors in there. Um, but it's still good. It's just not my fave. Beachfront blanket, that's my fave from that from that collection. <laughs> okay, so next up, we have, let's see, raspberry, um, tangerine, which is a sweet, bright mix of wild raspberries, fresh tangerine, and lemon zest. So this is going to be um, a citrus scent, obviously. Eight ounces, $15.50. This one is not on sale online. I did purchase it for half price in the store. Here it is. I love this packaging because it's just simple. I love that it sort of um, ha fades from a darker orange to a brighter orange. Um, what is that called? That is so, so pretty, you guys. Looks like an orange drink on a hot summer day. So yeah, you know, when you get on camera, you tend to forget about, you know, some things and you're like, what is that called and what is it? And um, there is a term for that, you know, when it changes the colors. You guys let, help me out in the comment section. But anyhow, <laughs> uh, let's see, raspberries. Mmm. Mm. It smells like fresh orange juice and lemonade all rolled into one. And I even get some grapefruit in there. I know it's not part of the scent notes, but yeah, like a refreshing drink, like I said, on a hot summer day. So that one smells really good. And I do recommend that one. And I do recommend Boardwalk Taffy. Um, I just feel that it just smelled like everything else, you know, that was sweet and cakey and, you know, something like that. The next one is Pink Watermelon. And this one is a sweet summer blend of Juicy Watermelon, Pink Petals, and Dewy Aloe. Retails for $15.50, eight ounces, not on sale online. And when I bought this in store, it was um, half price. Hopefully it goes to 75% off. Yes. <laughs> okay, let's try the Pink Watermelon. Mmm. Mmm, this one does smell very refreshing. You get the watermelon. I get sweet watermelon. That's what I get. Um, like a watermelon drink or like a watermelon. I don't know. This reminds me of the watermelon um, now and later. <laughs> the candy. This one smells more like the candy than Boardwalk Taffy. But of course, Taffy does have a light sugary scent. So I get it. It's just that I don't know. I just want it more. But anyhow, this is the pink watermelon, and it has that pink ombre effect. There we go. <laughs> We're getting our words back. Um, so this is so pretty, but simple. That smells really good. Refreshing watermelon on a hot day by the pool. You can pack these, put them in your beach bag, and take them with you for sure. So... Out of the three that I've just shown you guys, I would say that Pink Watermelon is actually my fave. This one smells like watermelon candy to me, but the other ones are still good. That one is just my fave out of these three that I have shown you guys. And I would definitely, definitely recommend all three of them, especially if you don't have the other sugary scents, then get this, get this to complete your collection. It is pretty, it does smell good. And then I'll show you raspberry tangerine again with the beautiful orange ombre. These are just so fun, you guys. They brought them out for semi-annual sale, and I think that that was great. I just really wish that these would go to 75% off because I will get more. And, you know, I'll go back and I'll get the shower gel um, and the body cream. And they have the scrubs, too. The scrubs look pretty amazing, so I want to try that. I hope they're not harsh, though, because you guys know I don't like the rocky, scratchy, rough, you know, violent scrubs like that. <laughs> um, I love the, you know, soft, sugary ones that, you know, just don't hurt your body and stuff like that. So yeah, you guys, um, I'm really uh, excited to see if Bath & Body Works is going to listen to us and get some more 75% off items for semi-annual sale. I was thinking that they might even cut the sale short. Um, some people were thinking that they should have never had it. Who knows, you guys, but yeah. So if you want to see more reviews, then just make sure you subscribe. Be sure to subscribe, okay? And then join me here next time.
Bye, guys.